Hello, all Jack, Jack families. Welcome to our live room. My name is Kerry Ryan. I'm a salesman of Indian Bangalore Market. This is my colleague. Hello, everyone. My name is Dabur. I am the salesman of Indian Bangalore Market. Okay, and today we are here. We are going to introduce our Jack A2S machine. The A2S? Really? Uh, I mean, we all know that the Jack have all series of machines. Why today we only come here to learn A2S? You know, uh, I have already promoted in this machine for nearly one year. I know it very well. Why I waste time again to learn it? Okay, very good question. We all know, like our Jack F4 machine, the direct drive machine is already in the market for more than five years. During those five years, our F4 is just dominating on the market. It's just like a Jordan in NBA. But when time goes by, the requirement of our customer is increasing. They want a machine based on F4, but have more, more function than F4. So this is why we're promoting A2S machine. And on, on another hand, you are saying you are already very familiar with our A2S machine. Yes. Then I have some question for you. How many A2S machines you sold in 2019? And how is the percentage of the A2S compared to all your sales? And how is the, your all service? Alright, alright. Um, I totally agree with you. I think you have a broad point. So why you not uh, why you not just go on and start your show? Okay. This is our A2S machine. Our A2S machine has some advantage like uh, very stable, reliable, and very high efficiency. For all of those specific points, I will introduce to you one by one later. And our A2S machine is the first choice for the mid and the low level customers. For the auto locking, it is still used Jack DNA Bajor and it's Germany industrial design and with very excellent workmanship and superb detail. And for the one, we still using the one shift driving motor. Some people will ask, why are you still talking about this one shift driving? This is not very high technology. But I want to say, on the one hand, this is our jack pattern. On another hand, like this design, is a combination of the motor company and the spare cost company. But our jack, we have our sub company named as Zhongbao. I believe all of you, almost all of you know this company. And as the first, when we design our A2S machine, the motor company and the spare parts company, they already have a cooperation. So they can design those two spare parts together. So it will increase the torque of the machine. So when we run the machine, it will be more light and more fast. And this is another pattern of our motor, like the dust proof design. It will decrease the heat of the motor and it will also achieve the dust proof. So this is why our jet motor, the life will be longer than other brand machines life. Uh, yes, I think I know this very well because all these features we are called for as a JIF DNA. And if my memory is something right, I think uh, all these features our Apple machine also have. So why you not show us the different features A2S has with F4? Of course, our A2S machine is based on F4 machine. And uh, as a computerized machine, our A2S have more functions. Now I can show you. Like on the head of the machine, it has the little compensate button. LED light button and the auto reserve swing button. For the middle compensate button, in the before, when we run the machine and we need the half need half speech, we should use our hand to turn the hand right. wheel, right? But now we just use one finger to touch here to click this button to achieve this function. And for the auto reverse swing, like before, we should use the, our hand to push this bar. After long time operation, it will be very tired. So we use this button to replace that, uh, uh, use this automatic function to replace that uh, hand hand. And how we achieve those function? In our machine, there are three electronic magnets, like electronic strength tension, and auto reverse trimming, and also auto trimming motor. So this is why our machine can achieve the auto reverse and auto trimming. Some of the customer. When we do the when I do the market survey, I saw those customers. I asked them why you don't buy our computerized machine. They will say the computerized machine is very good, but uh, our labor they don't know how to use those patterns. There are so many buttons, and they are also very afraid to learn of this function. So today, today we are here to give the training how to use those patterns. It will be very easy to learn, and it will achieve so many functions. Okay. 
So actually, firstly, uh, we can see on this panel, on this panel, on this panel, we can see uh, in each buttons there are two different icons on it. Uh, every icon means different functions. So when we want to turn on or turn off one function, uh, do you know how we to, uh, how we operate to switch? Uh, we can see here, uh, this one for example, this button has two different icons. The above one means double use stitch, uh, and the below one means the pattern, uh, the programming functions. So when we want to achieve this, the above function, double use stitch, we just uh, short press this button. Then this uh, uh, function will be turned on. After turn on this function, we need to set the parameters to achieve this function. First, we turn on this function, then we then we press this uh, button to set each parameter. The first uh, parameters means the first parameters means the totally line numbers that we want. Because you know the W stitch is like the stitch come and back, come and back. So if we want to, uh, um, how to say, when we want to uh, make the stitch much stable, we can use the W stitch function. Um, Uh, so this is the first number. The first number we set is for the totally line line numbers we want. For example, uh, this pattern, we count and then two lines. So we can set uh, two set uh, the first number as two. That means that the stitch will count and then. If we want to set three uh, three lines, means the stitch count back and count. Then we can set three as the first number. And the second number means uh, the lines. How many stitch? Uh, the lines order. Uh, we are set. For example, we want to set the first line is a stitch number. Then we need to uh, set this the second number to one. Then it means we are setting parameters for the first line. Hmm. You can see this is the second number is three. Now it means we are setting the length, the stitch numbers for the third line. So this function is usually applied on uh, label attaching, especially for the shirt color label. Later we will show you uh, on the machine, then you will uh, see more details. Uh, the second function is the front. The second uh, function is the front and the back tagging. Uh, this is uh, uh, like a, a simple stitch before the stitch and uh, the end of the stitch. There are sometimes the uh, Customers are requiring a special craft, like a joint. Um, it requires for the, it requires firm firm stitch. So using a front back packing, we can make sure that the stitch will be much stable. And the third function is the programming sewing. Um, first, we, uh, we we can see uh, which are job video. Uh, through the video, we can see here, we want to make two uh, short lines. The first line and the second line. Um, to achieve this function, we need to first turn on the pattern sewing function. This button, we can see the below, below icons means the uh, pattern sewing function. So we just long press this button, and this function will be turned on. Then we need to connect this button to set the parameters for the pattern. Um, and it is very similar to the WC parameter setting. The first number is the lines, lines number we want. And the second number is the lines order that we are setting parameters for. And the third, third and the fourth parameter means the stitch numbers we want to set. Later we will also show you in the demo machine so that you will uh, understand easier. Oh, 
Okay, so camera comes here, then we can show more details to our audience. Um, so actually, when when we are uh, actually when we are using this function, we will make some difficulties. One is that uh, how to set the speech, how to set the speech numbers. Uh, earlier, when we are visiting some factories, some workers they are afraid of using this UBT machine because they don't know each icon stands for. Um, actually, this is very easy for them to set parameters. The whole process will be like, firstly, uh, we need to count the stitch numbers in one, uh, in one production, how many the stitch numbers is. Uh, like, for, to make it easier, to save time, today we already count the stitch numbers we, we, uh, we need. Uh, for example, this line, we need 46 stitches, and this line, we need 25 stitches. So, after we work out these stitch numbers, after we work out these stitch numbers, we just set parameters on this handle. Now we want the uh, pattern sewing function, so we just uh, long press this button. And after we see this LED light is turned on, that means the function is active. Then we can click this button to set the parameter. The first number is the line numbers we want. Now we need two li four lines, so we just set it as four. And the second, line, second number is the uh, line orders that we are setting. For example, now I wanted to set the first line as 46. I needed to make the second number be one. That means I was setting for the first line. Then the third and the fourth numbers is the stitch numbers we want. We need it to be 46. It already be 46. Then after, after setting the first line, we are setting parameters for the second line. The second line, we want 25 stitches. All right, we, our technician has already done it for me. And the third line, same 25. The fourth line, 46. After finished, we click this S button to save. Then we can actually run this machine. Uh, and uh, uh, now I will ask our technicians to show this to us. Uh, now we can see uh, when the uh, pattern sewing function is turned on, when we finish the, the first line, the machine will automatically stop. Then uh, after we adjust the uh, piece, fabric piece, um, then we can start the second line. See, uh, so uh, we can see the machine will automatically stop according to our pattern. Uh, so it means uh, even the workers was not well trained. Uh, they can also manage manage this uh, uh, craft. Okay, I think our technicians may have made some mistakes, but it's not improved as the effect. You can see the stitch. Here's our uh, machine technicians. He also don't have the experience working in the garment factory, but after his one time, two times practice, he can also make, a, a, I think, maybe a, a good stitch. So uh, using this function, we can make the production much more standard. And uh, we no need to hire skilled workers. It will help the factory owners to save their labor cost and also save the time. Uh, and uh, next, uh, I will show you the W stage application. Firstly, we also need to turn on the W stage function, the same button uh, as the pattern sewing function. But this is about all icons, so we just uh, short press. We can see the AOD light is turned on. That means W stitch is active. Then we just set the parameters for the W stitch. Um, connect this uh, round button. And the first, uh, the first one means the stitch. When the stitch comes, how many stitches we want? Here we already uh, measured our label size. We need, uh, we need three uh, nine stitches. And the second number is when the stitch go back how many stitches we want. And according to the size of the label, we already set it for nine. And the, uh, the third and the fourth number means how many times we want it to come and back. Two means the stitch, the needle will come and back two times. Okay, so we already set the correct parameters. We just save it. Okay, our technicians will show, show it. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, this is only only a single demo. You can see it. The speed is very fast and uh, also very firm. And this also uh, have a function uh, of uh, in front front back hacking. This function uh, is to fix to make the starting stage and the end stage much more firm, not easy to lose. Because you know our A2S machine have the function of automatic trimming. Some of the factories owner may ask uh, if because our uh, auto trimming functions will keep the stage, stage uh, thread remaining within five mm. Uh, some of the customers will ask. If your thread remaining is so short, um, what uh, what to do if the thread losing is happen? Then I will tell them we have the function of front and end backtacking to make the stitch much firm. To active the function of front and backtacking, we just uh, turn on this one. This is the start backtacking, and this is the end backtacking. And our technicians will show you it. You can see here is the uh, start back tacking. And here and uh, also have the back tacking. It makes the stage much strong. Okay, and uh, we will show you one more time. Okay, I think I have uh, you have uh, a basic uh, knowledge about these machines, how to switch these buttons, uh, how to switch, switch these functions. So I think uh, uh, once the, when this uh, live show begins, our host, Mr. Lucian, have told you that we will have some uh, award-winning questions. So here comes our first questions. Do you know how to switch? You can see in one button, they have two icons. That means that stands for two different functions. So how we operate? How we achieve the function switch? Can you tell us how to switch two different functions in one button? This is a award-winning question. You can send your uh, answers in your mobile phone. Then we, you will got one spare part gift. OK, OK, my, maybe my question is a little complicated. So I just uh, simplify it. Uh, my question is uh, how to open the um, Python sewing, oh, no, no, the programming sewing function. If anyone knows, just uh, tap your answers on your mobile phone and send it to us. If your answer is correct, we will give you a gift. Anyone knows? OK, maybe the answer is too long for you, for you to tap on. So I just uh, simplify my question again. Um, if I wanted to achieve the function of pattern so, uh, programming sewing, and I need to Long press this button or short press this button. If you think the answer is to, is the long press button, just send one. And uh, if you think the answer is short press this button, just send two. Please type your answers and send us. If you think uh, I need to uh, long press this button to achieve the programming sewing, please send one. If you think I need to short press this button to achieve the programming sewing, please send two. Okay, one of our audience have uh, sent us his uh, answers. One stand for long press, and two stand for short press. How? Uh, what? What kind of operations I have to have, have to do to realize the function of programming? Programming sewing. Yes, yes, yes. Long press is the answers. If we want to achieve the function of pattern programming sewing, we need to long press this button. If we just short press this button, it will switch to the W stitch. Uh, I think most of the, some of your uh, some of our audience have given the correct answers. So uh, uh, our staff will check and uh, select some of you to send this. Uh, spare parts gift pack. And we will have one more uh, question and answer. 
that means you will Jose, you will have one more chance to win this gift. Please keep your attention on. Okay, now the uh, simple demo for this APS machine is finished. So let's go back to the screen. Thanks for the first coming of the of the function of our APS machine. Thank you. And uh, during this market, APS promoting, we also do a lot of work in the market. Today I can show you some videos of some compare with our APS machine with other brand launch motor machine. We will see the difference with two machines. This video is uh, totally in manual, and uh, we have one APS machine and another pump motor machine. They are doing the pocket wheeling swing. And uh, this testing is in same time to same operators, how many pocket attending they can do. So this is our APS machine. We can say the operator just use the hand and uh, with the leg to operate this machine. And this is another crunch motor machine. When they run in this machine, they should use the um, fresh board lift. And uh, it has no training function. After swing, they need to use the use hand to thread all this stitching. And this is a half, ne half needle compensate. So he should use the hand to turn the hand wheel. So from two operators, we can say, after a long time operating, the people use the launch motor machine will be very tired. And this is the five minutes testing. And now we can calculate how many point attending they can do in same time. So can you tell me uh, finally how many uh, pieces our different machines get and uh, the current model machine get? In five in five minutes, our APS machine finished eighteen pieces of the pocket pocket attending working, and the current motor only finished the uh, eleven eleven pieces of the pocket attending. And uh, for the stitch, we can check for our APS machine because it has auto training function. So no need the helper to do the. Thread, thread cutting, we can check the stitch, very beautiful and very short, no like a long thread tail. And for other punch motor machine, it still need the helpers to do the cutting of the thread tail. We can say the thread tail. So from this video, it is very obvious our A2S the efficiency is much higher than normal punch motor machine. So if we use this video show to the customers, it is very easy to make them change their idea. What is the best machine suitable for them? Which machine can increase their efficiency? And which machine can help them to save labor, save, save customer salary, and save time, and also save the power? So uh, from one simple demo and then uh, introduce, uh, from Mr. Kerry, uh, we can imagine those functions where we can uh, apply on. Uh, because, uh, like for this piece, we can see this pocket uh, attention uh, was realized by function of our programming sewing. So, our APS machine is very suitable for shirt making. And uh, you can see here the shirt's color uh, corner label. We can also use our W stitch very easily achieve. And also for this. Uh, for the label of jeans, we can also use our head sewing, uh, programming sewing function to make a small box. And the uh, project also, jacket also, I thought we are in our jacket. Uh, and uh, you know, uh, our APS machine, uh, it has the DNA design uh, of jeans. It has the uh, single shift driving, which means the uh, puncture, the puncture power will be much stronger. It will make the APS machine much adapted to middle and heavy material. So it will also suitable for jeans and jackets. 
So, uh, so can can you tell me? I know, Vindre, I know you. Uh, your work in Bangalore. Earlier, you are promoting the impact machine from the very beginning. So, can you share us some experience how to promote one machine from zero? Mm -hmm. It's a very good question. Okay, we can say from these pictures. Tell me, what can you say from those pictures? I see. It's a big market. I see chance, I see money. Yeah. Why be promoting A2S machine? That's back from. There are so many user machines in the market, and this is, means there are so many market requirements. And for the direct drive machine, the profit is lower than before. And the operator salary is higher than before. So this is why we need the high efficiency machine. And uh, for our agent, it has changed to us to promoting A2S machine to get higher profit. And uh, this is how we do our exchange from old machine to new machine activity. At the beginning, our agent should ask all of these via come together and have a meeting to introduce this machine and to explain the activity. And after that, our office and our agent will plan all the time together to give the training of how to use this computerized machine and how to give the proper service, especially for the service of the control box. And after that, we can go to the market with our sub dealer key. We can prepare some small gifts and uh, we will prepare the leaflet, and we go to the from one small government territory to another one, and we will introduce our machine, and we will introduce our activity. And we can see this is a picture of me and Mr. Eric. We cross one small territory to another one. And this is a picture of our roadshow. After all of this market serving, we will introduce the machine, and we invite all the customers come. So they, we put the roadshow. They will come and they can try our machine and they will know how is the efficiency, how is the performance of our machine. And we also make some flex when we deliver those machine, it has machine from in that one industrial area to another one. So the plan can make more people, they can see the machine, they can see the block of our machine. Uh, and uh, we also done uh, so many activities uh, and advertisements. Um, like for this one, uh, in every uh, Entrance of the industrial area, we will put banners and uh, we even put uh, some uh, leaflets advertisements uh, on this auto car. And uh, we also rent some um, advertisement box to put our APS uh, machines on. Um, we just uh, try to make an atmosphere in the market so that when the customer is thinking about to change their machines, the first brand and the first models come to their head will be APS machines. So it will be benefit for us to uh, when we truly start to promote this machine. Um, because you know, uh, after four five years promoting for direct driving machines, now in India, everyone using direct driving machines, and uh, uh, more and more imitators comes around. Almost every brand has their own direct driving machines. So if we want to win the market, we must make sure that we are always faster than other brands faster than our competitors, at least half step. And step by step, uh, our efforts will finally become, how do we will gain, gain the, how do win the uh, customers in the market, win the night market present. And here are two pictures. Uh, those are the, uh, some countries, they took our e machines. They took the e machine by exchange. Uh, earlier, here yeah, are uh, all, all the some older machines. Machines, some older machines. Some of the machines are even 10 years older. So uh, we threw the exchange activity. We changed all these older machines to our brand new e machines. Okay, thank you. This is how we know the e machine and how we promoting e machine. And uh, later, if you have some questions, you can type in your questions in the application and we will give the proper answers. So if you have any questions, feel free to type in on the application. Okay, now it's our question and answer. Uh, so if you have any doubts about our APS machines, you just send your questions in the group. And uh, we will also uh, choose our, some of our audience, those who are giving the questions, we will send them our real part in the so this is bag including scissor, tweezer, white oil, and a looper, and some feed dog, and the pressure food. 
So this is a very good fit. You can get this and give it to your customer or you can put it in your shop. It is all very good. So when you see so many stuff, you pay. You don't want to look at it. In China, RMB, it is 108. And I think in, in dollars, it will be almost like uh, 20 dollars. Okay, so please, if you know the answer, if you have any questions, you can type in on the application. Okay, I can see here comes to our first questions. One audience is asking how to adjust the speed. Really? I think this is a very basic question. Can you give the answer? Is it carrying? It is the most basic function of our equation machine. Just to use the touchpad, just to use our A2S panel, the plus and the minus button to just uh, can adjust the speed of the machine. Uh, here we can see uh, to adjust the speed of this machine. We just to click these two buttons. The above one means to speed up, and the below one means to speed down. And I, I can see that uh, another customer, uh, another audience is asking, what's the maximum speed of this machine? And by adjusting the speed, we can see, we can see our machine's maximum speed can be 5,000. So you can give one more question. Okay, the third question, I can see, well, for all you things asking, how to uh, set the temporary reset? It's also a very basic question. You can come here and be the more details of the machine. Here is a button, especially for factory reset. So we just uh, long press this button. Now we can see the machine is reset to the factory setting. All the parameters are changed to the factory setting. Uh, and one of our audience is asking how to count the stitch numbers. Uh, so, as this piece, for example, firstly, if we want to count this pocket stitch numbers, uh, we can, uh, we firstly, to how to say, uh, fully lace sewing, sewing it. Uh, for example, we, we, uh, we sewing it and we can account the stitch, the host number, the host number. Uh, we just uh, account the host number, then we will know the stitch numbers. But uh, there will be some small difference between the whole numbers and the stitch numbers. You need to make maybe one to two stitch at the chest. So, uh, like for this piece, uh, if I want to count these stitch numbers, I just uh, personally, uh, very casually, to so, to uh, taking this this shape and uh, generally counting these uh, whole numbers. Then I will know a general general number. Then maybe we just uh, adjust the one to two stitches. After that, I will know the stitch numbers. Can you understand this? Okay, thank you for all Jack family's question. It's a very good question. And uh, now we are with a lucky job. Please um, type in three six like six 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 in the application, and uh, our our work our working staff will do the screenshot. If uh, your if your double six showing the screen, you will get our big gift back. And then in our big bag, there are so many our Jack original spare parts, like this scissor. This scissor is Jack scissor. In the videos, we can see it even can cut the chicken legs. So if you use this uh, scissors for the fabric, it will be very easy to cut all of the fabrics. And like other Jack original spare parts, like this, original white oil for the machine. All the audience, don't forget to put a three six in the application. And have you, some of you already received this, this tracer. And all of these spare parts, even you can see in your shop. 
And if you want to place the order, you can connect with the spare parts department and place the order. Okay, regarding the time issue, today our Jet A2S global production line is almost finished. And thanks for your support and thanks for your work working. And uh, the day after tomorrow, we will have another flight and uh, another team will give the light for another product. And uh, today, all of you do not forget to finish all the feedback form. Thank you. And uh, uh, if you have one more question, you, just, you can also send in our WeChat group or Team Talker group. Uh, we, we will check and give you the answers. Oh, thank you. Thank you.